Hello, everybody. Yeah, good morning. Hello. <laughs> good afternoon. Good evening, wherever you are. My name is Steve Solat. I'm president of the Latin American Training Center, LATC. And this evening, Kate Lira is with me to discuss uh, our program this year. We're very excited to explain that this year, for the first time, we have an online program of the Global Film and Television Immersion Program with a number of fantastic opportunities for filmmakers from all over the world. Today, we're going to be explaining a little bit about the structure of the program and also to guide you through some of the opportunities that you will have, which are open both to young and emerging filmmakers, directors, producers, screenwriters, as well as lawyers and government regulators, and also experienced professionals. There's something for everybody in this program. I also want to explain that we have been running this program for 11 years. This is actually the 12th program that we have been hosting. However, this program is unique because this year it will be online with a combination of pre-recorded sessions and uh, also some live Q&A sessions as well as networking. And uh, we'll be discussing a little bit more about those opportunities in just a minute. Uh, we have a number of participants from all over the world that have been with us for these programs. And I just wanted to mention that so far, we have had participants from Argentina, Australia, Brazil, Cambodia, China, Chile, Colombia, Ecuador, Ghana, Japan, Lebanon, Mexico, New Zealand, Nigeria, India, Italy, Pakistan, the Philippines, Spain, South Korea, Taiwan, and Vietnam. This program is organized, as I mentioned, by LATC, the Latin American Training Center. And the reason for that is the origin of this program was exclusively for Latin America. However, it has become so popular that it now, it now attracts participants from all over the world. The program is also supported by the Motion Picture Association and uh, especially the Asia Pacific office, which has a number of participants, which will be included in this year's program. Now let's talk a little bit about the structure of the program this year. Um, in this year, this year, we will actually be able to accommodate different time zones. So although the sessions are dedicated to three hours per day, every day during two weeks, the participants will be included in sessions for three hours. There are two different time zones. And so we, we will be having 6 p.m. to 9 p.m. Pacific time or 8 p.m. to 11 a.m. Pacific time. So you will be receiving a customized schedule according to your own time zone. So you will not have to be worried about looking up what time your session will be beginning uh, or ending. Um, we have a number of fantastic speakers and we urge you to please look at the landing page of the program, which contains all the details, including the uh, list of speakers and other features, which are the panels and networking opportunities, and also the tentative schedule. We're, we're saying that this is a tentative schedule because we have so many speakers that many of them cannot lock in their schedules until two weeks before we actually begin the program. 
So we will confirm all times in each day and send you the final schedule two weeks before we actually begin. As you can see, we have a huge variety of well-known qualified speakers who will be speaking on a number of uh, topics which are relevant for both emerging and experienced professionals. It's important for you to become familiar with this landing page because not only does it have the content, but uh, it has the tentative schedule. And also when you scroll down, you will see that it has a, a section on the costs and the, then the choice of, of sessions and types of passes, because you may be able to choose certain sessions, certain panels and certain um, speakers, or you can choose the, the full pass, which will allow you to participate in everything, including the pitch training and the pitch session. Uh, so now I'd like to turn it over to Kate Lira, who is going to be explaining a little bit more about how the pitch training and the pitch panel works. Please, Kate. Thank you. So I'd just like to sort of um, resume some of the things you've mentioned. Um, one of our taglines for the program is survive and thrive in the audiovisual industry. And I think it's fascinating how they've managed to set up a schedule where you can decide what you actually want to study. You can do a complete program and, or you can do special things that you think will, would be better for you to sort of um, brush up on. Yeah, so it's good for everybody from every sort of a level, from very beginners to people that are actually out there in the industry for some time. And I think the other thing that is most exciting for me this year is not only, well, the workshop of pitching, which is wonderful. It has, we have one masterclass, two sessions of pitch prep workshop, but the pitch panel. And this is amazing because uh, if you think about it, this is a unique opportunity to get extra eyes on your project. So if you want to pitch your project in a live streamed event and receive feedback from LA based leaders and experts, this is really for you. And just right up off the top, I'm gonna to say that the deadline for program applications and video pitch submissions is September 17th. But so what do you have to do? You could send in your video um, submission and then a special channel of a group of um, LATC and other people will take a look at the pitch, your live, your pitch uh, that you've sent in and choose 10 participants. Um, this is a unique opportunity to pitch live you submit your video pitch and you receive feedback from LA-based industry experts. So what, do you, or what are you going to be needing for that? We are going to be judging on the basis of creativity and innovation, skill and emotional commitment to, of your self to your actual project and your delivery, focus clarity and market potential. So um, it's, yeah, I'm really excited also about the fact that I'm gonna be able to work with you on a more, uh, a long, more long-term basis about um, how you're working your delivery for your pitches. And um, I also kind of wanted to go into the idea that LATC has always been so completely dedicated to the idea of politica de inclusione diversity inclusion and diversity. We have partners with several sec sectors in, throughout Latin America. We're offering uh, all sorts of um, um, bolsas, how, what, are, what are bolsas? How do you say that? <laughs> yeah, and um, I think that you can check out on the site how you can apply for this. So, um, I'd like to turn this back over to Steve. 
Okay, thank you, Kate. Let, let me just um, run down a few of our favorite topics of the speakers so you can have a, an idea of the content. Uh, we're gonna begin with uh, a presentation on the US and global film industry, introductions, challenges, and trends. We also have speakers on distribution of your content, whether it be a feature film or a short, or a series. Uh, we have a session on copyright and chain of title, which is very important to understand the importance of intellectual property rights for your project or finished project, finished product. We also have a session on the film festival circuit, so you can understand how to use the film festivals to get your content in front of co-producers, uh, distributors, and uh, platforms. We have a session on the economic recovery of the industry following COVID-19. Uh, there will be another very important session on uh, direction, the film director, and the importance of the director in the final product. We also have an important session on screenwriting and what is the power of the screenwriter uh, and his role throughout the production, as well as how to register your script with the Writers Guild of America or in the country of origin. We have a couple of different sessions on film finance. This is critical for those of you that have projects that are gonna be uh, looking for money. And we have also a couple of different types of sessions on incentives and film commissions. It's important to understand what a film commission is, how it can help you, how it can support your actual production and logistics on the ground, and how film commissions also open the door to production incentives, cash rebates, tax credits, other types of production incentives. So we have a quite a huge variety of sessions, and we urge you to look at the landing page to understand better uh, what kind of session you may be interested in if you're, if you're not going to be in the, uh, in the group with a full, full pass. Now, regarding the full pass, that one does open the door to the networking sessions. And I'm gonna ask Kate to explain a little bit how the networking sessions work and their value. Go ahead, Kate. Yeah, I think that one of the things we've discovered throughout the years has been the fact that people uh, have a chance to network, not only with the other people taking the class, but also with some of our speakers who suddenly will pop into some of these networking sessions. And uh, it's really kind of amazing to see how people from different countries, with, but with like interests can um, generate uh, exchanges and co-productions and what have you. So I think that the networking is going to be really interesting. You can have, we can, we have breakout sessions where you can be with a group of people or you can be one-on-one. -on -one. It's, um, it's just kind of like amazing. And so um, that also is pretty much well explained on the landing page. And I really encourage people to participate in this because You'll have a chance if you're, you've signed up for a package which will include the networking, you can network with people from your space or around the world. I mean, it's just the sky's the limit as they say. So I encourage you to take a look at that and um, take advantage of it. Right, I think this is a very important feature that you can only find this kind of opportunity with our program. Uh, so as Kate explained, not only will you have the chance to meet and greet your fellow participants from all over the world and talk about each other's projects, but also with the speakers. So you have uh, really two for the price of one in, in that sense. So, um, uh, and, and you'll also be able to talk about how film markets work uh, in, as part of the networking opportunity. So, uh, don't miss this opportunity. I know a lot of you will have questions because there's a lot of information on this landing page. Um, we spent a lot of time organizing this 
but feel free to contact us. Um, and Fernanda Lima, who is the coordinator of the logistics of the program, will be standing by to answer your questions. And uh, we look forward to seeing you. Um, and you can, she is actually um, sending you on the chat here her email, which is fernanda.latc at gmail.com. So please forward your questions. And we hope to see you soon in October in this year's exciting program.